I tried so hard and got so far But in the end, it doesn't even matter Like seriously, I'm so upset. Welcome back everybody to me being angry and upset. Should at least had her move over here. No support. Their support's maxed, their support's maxed, their support's maxed. No support. No support. No support. Who needed healing? Oh, this guy. You never had support. Um, I bet these guys didn't get support. No support. I'm good. I did good this chapter. That guy almost died from a thief. <laughs> Why do you need reinforcements? There's nothing here. Lord Hector, are you unharmed? Protect Lord Hector, Knights of Ostia, attack! Attack who? I'm overpowered. Hey, Greybeard, are these guys? Yes, I'm sure of it. They are his morphs. It's true. They're all eerily sim similar. That reminds me. That man on Valor, Ephidel, Black Fang's son, so er, Black Fang Sonia, not son. They're son in Sonia, don't judge me. Black Fang Sonia, too. Are you saying that he made them all? It is an abomination, a crime against all that is natural. When Nurgle begins using morphs to carry out his plans, his power had grown beyond our ability to contain him. After humans, his next target became the essence of dragons. His next target- Okay, doing that voice is giving me a headache for some reason. His next target had to be Arcadia. I concealed our paradise behind a curtain of sandstorms. Then I hid in the underground ruins and waited for him. I did not hope to defeat him, just exchange blows. Yeah, exchange blows, that's what I'm... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and then draw him into the desert, which would be his end. But the working oracle never showed up, did he? Correct. I have no idea how he managed it, but he called those siblings to the dragon's gate, and now... He plans to call a horde of dragons to this land. What do I have to do to stop him? Our last hope is the power of the legendary items. It would take too long for us to gather all of them. I will go to the Shrine of Seals and tell Bramimond everything. We must have his power no matter the cost. We shall go to the dragon gate ahead of you. What? That's a good idea. Even though you cannot harm Nurgle himself, you can certainly do some damage to its troops. If we don't answer Nurgle's invitation soon, he'll continue to send out troops after us. If that's going to happen, we might as well take the fight to him. I won't have Lycia ravaged by any more of his acts. Ew. You truly are Roland's children. I am old. I did not expect anything to surprise me again, yet. What is it? It takes the strongest of bonds to alter the course of fate. Go. Go, my youthful friends. Set your sights on the Dragon's Gate and keep moving. Yeah, that voice is seriously giving me a headache. I had to stop. I don't know what it is about old man voice. Even though it wasn't even my proper old man voice. Eh, whatever. Eliwood, what happened to Durandal? He's right here. I'm sorry. I simply couldn't bring myself to wield it. Let me have it for a while. Is that alright? Yes. Eliwood, I understand how you feel. But without this weapon... We won't be able to stop Nurgle. You know that, don't you? Yes. When I next wield it, I won't hesitate. I know. Please. What? You know what? I might actually look up how many chapters there are because this is insane. I kind of don't want to, but I also kind of do. Oh, sure, why not? Where's my phone? I'm gonna look that up. Actually, where is my phone? My phone's just gone. We received word from Captain Fargus. If you come to bed on, you give us passage to the Dread Isle. Well then, let's get going. It would be best if we outfitted ourselves before setting out. We'll need many supplies for a campaign on Valor. And the cast town here is better stocked than Brandon, I'm sure. Badal, I'm sure. 
We can empty the coffers here and sell the treasures if need be. Corrump! Uh, uh, wait, what? Uh, within our limits, of course. Say, three, 30,000 gold. That seems unreasonable. Come on, lay the way. I don't really understand what's going on. Ostia's castle town is as impressive as ever. Shops and items of all types imaginable. For generations, our ancestors dedicated themselves to a sort of frugal militarism. Nobles and commoners are like shunned extravagance. Corrupt neither the body nor the mind, they cried. Since the time of Roland, this has been the dominant ideology in Ostia. I heard that when Lord Uther first participated in the Lycian Council as Marquess Ostia, he gave a sca scathing indictment of the peer system. Now I understand. His philosophy had its roots in the history of Ostia itself. That's right. Yet his thinking. It threatens the lifestyles of many of our aristocrats. I don't care about politics. So some groups may view my brother as with enmity. I must grow wiser so that I could set my brother's side and aid him. Of course, my fighting skills are not yet what they should be. But this isn't the place for that kind of talk. We've got to get going. Come on. Yes, I will go with you. Curious. Good is it, Lindyek? Hector. He acts like such a brute, but he takes his duty seriously. Hector has always been a man of firm character. And, uh... My controller is just friendly. It's not even... Saying on player two, it's just not working. There we go. I don't understand. I've always envied him for that. His ability to conceal any doubt he feels about himself or his actions. I know. I'm a little envious too. If what? He doesn't get second guess what he must do. No hesitation. I mean, I wouldn't hesitate about anything concerning my grandfather's health. In fact, I'd be happy to do anything I could. I thought I was all alone in the world. And that of the found family, I don't want to lose him. I know what you mean. I can't bear to think of losing my mother. If I survive, I'll lose. I want to be at my mother's side. Just do anything she asks. Nothing is more important than family. Yet, in my heart, the plains still call me. The never-ending oceans of grass. The memory of that scent alone is enough to leave me weak. Vindic. Hey. Oh wait. Hey, what are you two doing? Let's get going, both of you. Well, <laughs> first we must deal with the menace before us. If we can't stop Nurgle, we lose everything dear to us. Let's go. Everything dear to us. Well, Elliot always has the best things to say, aka repeating what other people. I can't. I can't use Oswin. I have to uh, just get out of here. Oh, Nino's there. But, uh... Oh yeah, I could get rid of Hector, so now I could have Nino and Yafar. Uh, that's about right, right? Da -da 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 -da. Okay, just do support. Ella Wood and Lynn. Urk and Sarah. Nino and Yafar. Rebecca and Lowen, and Kent and Sane. Yeah, that's about right. Oop, wait. Oh, I used the wrong button. Like, do I have- No, I don't have the fucking sword. He just refuses to use it, that bastard. Uh, everyone looks like they still have some good shit. <sighs> I don't... I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't even care. Oh, I don't need That doesn't even matter. I like how it's just we're going... Wait, what? This is all the map is? Um, sure. Formation. Wait, what are these? These are the shot. Hmm. This is really weird. This is really weird. What is... Alright, then. It's a really tiny map. Is it literally just battle preparations? Lord Hector, Sir Oswin, I have brought you to the 30,000 to cold. Thanks for yelling that out, man. Wow. 
That's literally all this is. Sure, why not? How close are we to the end? Is this literally the end? That I'm just... I'm just buying three of everything. I don't need another fire. Like, this is really fucking weird. <laughs> What's over here? Levels of items could build your fortune, you know. You all just search through any chest you cut. Really? That's literally just so, like, what? All right. Give me a couple of long bows. Give me a couple of short bows. Give me a killer bow, a silver bow, and I like iron bows. This is really fucking weird. I'm gonna finish shopping and then see you next time.